First, I'm going to apply Max Paint Pot and Paint Truly as my base. I'm going to apply this all over the eyes. And I'm going to go ahead and set that with the Coconut Cream Eyeshadow from the Too Faced and My Sweets Chocolate Bar. Then I'm going to be applying this color with my MAC 286 brush and I'm going to go back and forth. This is going to be my transition color above the crease, slowly building up the color. Now I'm going to go ahead and grab this beautiful color and I'm going to be applying this precisely on my crease, going back and forth very gently, kind of creating a cut crease you can say. I'm going to go ahead and blend that out with my MAC 286 brush. On the tip of my brush, I'm going to apply the same color that I applied on my crease and just go back into the crease with it, trying to blend everything out. But focus on the crease. Now I'm going to go ahead and use the same brush and apply this color. On my crease, I'm trying to blend the transition color and the crease color so there won't be any awkward transitions. I'm going to go ahead and apply the same color that I applied on my crease, that dark color on the outer part of my eye, connecting it to the crease. I'm just going to blend that out. I'm going to go ahead and apply a maze from ColourPop Cosmetics, such a beautiful color. I'm going to apply this with my fingertips on my eyelid. I'm in love with these eyeshadows, they're so amazing. I'm applying with my fingertips because this is the best way to get the best application with these eyeshadows. Now I'm going to go ahead and blend that out on the outer part of the eye. I'm going to grab some of that color just to darken up that area. Now I'm going to go ahead and apply the color Fringe from ColourPop. And now I'm just going to apply that on the tear duct just to give me a nice highlight. Then I'm going to go ahead and grab this color. And I'm going to be applying this on my lower lashes to give it a smoky effect. I'm just going to blend that out. That completes the look. look i hope you guys liked this tutorial if you did make sure you hit that like button subscribe and drop a beautiful comment and if you create this look make sure to get a picture and tag me on instagram use the hashtag ashley marlin any requests or anything like that leave them down below and uh, make sure to follow me on instagram twitter or snapchat that way we can interact and um yeah i'll see you guys next time